Hello guys, welcome to my channel. I hope everything is okay in your life. In this video, I will present you the first episode of second season of the Road to Video series. The previous series was prepared as Road to 730 G score. In this series, my goal is to reach the 750 G score hard cap. If you haven't watched the 730 G score series before, my advice is this. Please watch this video after watching that 730 G score series. At the same time, I try to present my experience by explaining the reason for my moves in the parts where I made explanations. Without further ado, let's move on to the video. See you in the analysis part. Enjoy watching.
Gönder gelsin. Hadi lan. Geç al telefonu alıyorum hadi. Anam. Ben yapmıyorum. Oyun yapıyor. Hadi. Hadi aslanım. Yapabilirsin. Geldin.
What the heck is that? You kidding me, blank screen? Okay, I think you watched all video. Video is such a game and you watched it. For some reason, it never gave me the title of RNG Carried. Maybe one day, in the future I will be referred as an RNG Carried. By the way, meaning of RNG Carried is not easy to get something. It is very easy to get what you need. This is the difference. Do not forget that. In other words, getting a tier 9 horse with value such as 4, 7, 10 fail stack you watched in the video does not work for me because I can buy it whenever I want. I cannot be RNG carried or you cannot be RNG carried unless the game gives me or you the things you need or I need easily. Such as for me, tier 10 horse, pandabos, pandowns and etc. Anyway, here is the build I have in my mind. In order to reach this build, I need to make double levels for my build. After that, it's not that hard. At least I can get pendants from marketplace. It's an item that can be obtained without risk. But I'm not sure about pendants, so it will optionally stay in the double narc build at the same time. I will not change the narc plus distal set, I will keep it for PvE purpose. On the other hand, I would like to share with you a build that I can abuse damage reduction and HP in PvP and that works really well for my class. The two cardio rings in this build you see on the screen feed my character a lot about DR and there is also the HP bonus feature. With this build, I will have 960-ish accuracy, 570-ish damage reduction, 7.5k to 8k HP and etc. 2 downs and 2 knocks, it depends situation I can equip whenever I want. But after all, I don't play evasion class and damage reduction class has always been treated as stepchild in this game. The build you see on the screen is suitable for only classes with passive DP feature. For example, Awakening Succession Warrior, Awakening Succession Wolf, and Succession Nova and etc. It's not as suitable for every damage reduction build class. Since I have conveyed my goals to you, I will not keep you any longer. Thank you very much for your interest in my channel. The channel is getting bigger every day and thank you. More people watch and benefit from the guides, spot reviews it has. If you have time, you should definitely check out my channel. Do not forget, video is just a game, have a nice game.